Hey, it's me, Furious G, and welcome back to Valda's story, Abyssal City. Uh, we are gonna continue from where we last left off, which is here in uh, Tagrum Village. We're following this, uh, following this chica. We got some more stuff going on here at the booth. The junk collector. So. If I trade 10 polished stones, I can get a rogue's cobble. This stuff doesn't really do anything for me, so here's Casey. This is the last operating mana heater in ta Tagrum. It keeps everything within its radius from completely freezing over. Well, that sucks. I'll do you guys I can. Humans can survive in areas without mana heaters. Yeah, that makes sense. Leave me alone. Okay. <laughs> Wait here, Wyatt. Oh, we got an old day. Ah, oh, good, you're back. I was beginning to worry about you, Atalan. You're wounded. I told you to be more careful when gathering supplies, did I not? Elder, it's just a scratch. I met this man out in the, the, the derelicts. He says he's a human from the surface. Is that so? Keep, oops, keep closer. Mm, much closer. Mm, feel me. Mm. <laughs> Step closer, outsider. Let me get a good look at you. My one eye. My name is Wyatt. I think I changed these voices a little bit. My name is Wyatt. I'm a traveler from Hyogokun. Traveler? Hmm. Tell me. Why exactly would you travel to shit in my hell? <laughs> we were hunting a demon and this music is awful loud. I wonder if I can Alright. Guys give me a minute. Um We had no idea Sithiel still existed. Others from my ship must have landed in the city. I need to find them. I'm Asian guy. I mean, like, really? Why are you closing your eyes? Do all travelers on the surface go around hunting demons? Does it matter? How do you expect us to trust you if you can't answer a simple question? Quiet, Jig. Jiggy. <laughs> it's obvious that what happened to Atalan would have been much worse if he had not shown up. Have you known any demon or angel to ever help one of us down here? He had no reason to help her, but he did. Elder, he is in... He's not a demon or an angel. He's like, he's human, like us. That is all the trust we need for now. <sighs> I'm sorry to say we have not seen any of your people from your ship. But maybe we can help each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Help me help you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we have lost contact with one of the other villagers due to increased angelic presence to the east. I had hoped to send Atlan on a task to re-establish communication with her. Sounds like he just died. But seeing as how she went and got herself injured, maybe may I ask you to take her place? Oh, it's your grandfather. Grandfather, wait. You can't ask an outsider to. Hush, child. He would fare much better than you at this. He's got a big old sword. You have fisty cuffs. You will stay here and have these wounds tended to. Yes, Elder. The people of her will not trust you when they see your hair. Take the package beside me and deliver it to them. My hair? What does that have to do with anything? You haven't noticed? Something down here has turned everyone's hair white. No one knows why exactly. Only demons and angels seem to retain their hair color. It helps us tell them apart. Yours will fade, too, in time. Tell them Elder T-Rare-Trare-Trare sent you. That might get you inside. Hopefully you may find information about your companions there. Why, take this look at this, or take this wall hook. You were needed to get to the. I was about to just. You were needed to. Uh, you were needed to get into the mausoleum district, east of here. 
So both angels and demons are being sent to this place. What are they up to? We don't know. They just began showing up about a year ago. Watch yourself out there. <laughs> Alright, so I can wall jump now. That's cool. Let's get spare parts. Switch to dark magic. Kind of already did, but I want to see what's over here. Dang it. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, that just leads to. I feel dumb. Strength so that I may cleanse this world of the shadow. Not even going to give my me a chance to explain myself. Typical Alligathian. So I guess for crafting, I'll have to like go to demons for certain things and go to these guys for the others. Oh, come on. Everybody seems to drop iron. Wait, let me... really quick. That's a little better. I'm being drowned out here. Oh, give me a... This is how I failed. <laughs> this is how I failed. Friggin... Jump puzzles. There we go. That I might have to drop down from above. Yeah. Nope. 
Yeah. Yeah. No. Timer. What do I have a timer for? Where am I going? What do I do? Where do I come from? Cotton Eye Joe. Oh, those are all closed. Maybe. Oh. Alright, so I gotta like. Run. And then I gotta. Do it. Do it. We're gonna do it one more time, and then we're gonna have to save it for another time. Uh. Oh, frick. One more time. Because that was just bad. Plus 15 armor, plus 5 resistance, immune to silence, freeze, mat, static, every 6th attack does a burst of light, magic, not that big of a deal. And this does 5% to attack damage and magic power. In focus mode, all damage is increased by 20%. Might as well take a look at it. And it doesn't change anything. Okay, not a big deal. Well, let's give it a roll. Rest in peace, Peche. Just taking a moment of silence for Peche. Boss, and I just rolled the drum. Okay. 
feel like the doors on this place are gonna close behind me any minute. I see the like the little green curtain there. <gasps> what the fudge? This could be a problem. I kinda wanna like go robotty. With elegance, blessing, delight shall wash your stain from this world. Always always begging your false god for power. Can't you do anything yourself? Why well, he's a robot. I oh no, he's a... Oh, he's got a shield. in this city yeah man I didn't even use my superpowers which I could just to see what they are I guess and a keystone wait hold right trigger to use them uh what does this do uh, oh, come on, it's the same button. All right, so we're at the frozen crypts. Whoops in the bloods. Uh, okay. There's an old mana generator. That's what would have kept this place going. Instead, it froze up. Ah. Oh. Must be another one of those feral creatures. The elder didn't mention they were in this area too. Oh, ow! <laughs> They're freaking loud. They sound weird, creepy. How do I get through? All right, well, I don't know how to get through there, even if I did turn it off. All right, so. That's where I gotta go. That explains it. So I gotta like get up here and then just run my butt up. Alright, let's forty four seconds is not bad. Oh. Oh, there's more than one maybe. Oh Okay, I was wrong. It is bad. Hit? <laughs> no? Okay. We're just gonna yeah. go down then. Thanks, we'll just leave. And we got another save point. Let's see here. I've been playing uh, a little while. Oh, we have to level up. So let's, uh, let's level up before we uh, call it a day. Let's see here. Our kind of feel like our biggest boost is again towards luck because of HP, MP, and crit. HP plus eight is just ridiculous. But we still want to bump 
our strength because that's continually something I'm using. And I'm not sure what A ruin is. I guess it's armor ruin. It says armor ruin, but I, I guess it means, I don't know. Intelligence boosts magic stuff. We know that, but we're not really focusing on that, so. Continue on strength. Skill points. Uh, we have one. We can increase attack damage by 5%. Combos of four greater. Oh, do we just want to go straight into more damage or more health? Or do we want to, like, add one of these for magic y stuff? Uh, you know what? We were just going to go straight into warrior. I hope that's the right choice. I mean, we got... We got plenty of health. 160 is not bad at all. Oh, and it looks like we have a soul meter. So I guess the more... Uh, light or dark magic we use... We get bonuses? I wonder if that affects the uh, entirety of the game. Huh. All right, everybody. Oh, is he getting cold? Yeah, he shivers. That's neat. I ain't cold. I ain't cold. That's kind of neat. Oh, his health's going down. Okay. So I didn't notice that before. I'm just gonna kind of combat it. Praise, praise, praise the sun. <laughs> Alright, ladies and germs, we are going to call it quits for here for now. Uh, we will see you next time on the next episode of Valda's Story, Abyssal City. Bye-bye.